Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel. And uh, so today, Patch Tuesday, we had, of course, uh, Windows 11 and Windows 10 updates. The last Windows 8.1 updates. So now it's end of support. And for extended support also, it's uh, for business. It's uh, end of uh, support for Windows 7. Now, what does it fix? Well, in all of the Microsoft products, there's 98 security fixes in here, one zero day flaw. Um, if we look at how these updates are divided in, uh, we have 39 elevation of privileges that are in there, four security feature bypass, there's uh, 33 remote code execution vulnerabilities, there is 10 information disclosure vulnerabilities, 10 denial of service, and two spoofing. And of course, there's one zero day that's fixed, already actively exploited, and uh, publicly disclosed. So uh, this is, you know, really bad. Uh, this is like the worst that you can be. Not only, um, you know, exploited in the wild, but it's a public disclosure. So that means everybody knows if they want to use it how to exploit the flaw. So this tells you how important it is to fix this. Uh, what do we have in here uh, for Windows? Because that includes every product. There's some updates for my, um, you know, Microsoft Office also today for security. Uh, if we look at the different uh, important and critical flaws, uh, we have, I'm going to look at the critical. Critical, we do have Windows Cryptographic Services. We do have uh, Windows Layer 2 Tunneling Protocol. There's also the Windows Secure Socket Tunneling Protocol, SSTP. So these are the critical flaws, and there's a lot of important, of course, in there, including Microsoft Graphics and so on. So lots of stuff uh, in here that are being fixed. And remember that that is part of the top security priority. Um, you know, forget antivirus. I always say it. People that think antivirus is uh, what is protecting you, you don't know what security is. It's not that. There's a lot of viruses and malware that go through antivirus without them even seeing it. What protects you is really keeping your system safe, your system up to date with its security updates like this, including your browser and all the software you use. And then it's your behavior. Remember, these are the two top security of your devices. Updates for security, your behavior online. That's 99% of all the security. So uh, check it out. It's important to apply. And of course, if anything pops up, I know some of you wait um, a little bit because of the fact that, you know, you never know. Sometimes updates could break something, uh, which is fine. Uh, but once, uh, you know, you notice everything seems to be all right, uh, don't hesitate to install to make sure that you are safe on Windows. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.